Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This week I just have another quick recipe for you. <laughs> um, it's just, I guess like fish parcels. So just a very quick um, recipe and quick video. So let's just get into the video. Right, so all you need for this is, I did already do some prep so it was um, easier. So all you need is, I've used four carrots. Um, because there's three of us, so two adults and one toddler, so I've already um, washed and peeled and everything. Then I've got about four and a half um, bulbs of garlic. Um, we don't use as much for a little one. And then three potatoes already washed um, and cleaned. We also need one lemon. Well, you won't use a whole one, it just depends how much lemon you like to use, but I've got one lemon, um, some parsley, pepper, white pepper, and then a really tiny bit of salt, and then I've got some unsalted butter left, and I'll probably use about a teaspoon per parcel. What I'm going to do is just put it in my foil. So you'll see in a minute. So I'm gonna do now is so I'm gonna take my carrots and my potatoes and I'm just gonna cut them. Oh, sorry, I didn't even mention the fish, I just realized. And just any fish that you like. I've just got cod fillets today and I'm gonna use one fillet per person. Um, but what I'm gonna do right now is I'm going to chop my carrots and I'm gonna keep my skin on, but you know, if you want to, you can take your skin off. Um, chop my potatoes into chunks and I am just going to boil them for five to ten minutes just so that they soften a little bit because the fish I cooked them frozen so they'll only take 20 to 25 minutes so that's it yeah so I've already put my hot water in there because I'm just gonna parboil boil them just so that they're a little bit soft before they go into the oven and my oven I've already put them to preheat I think it's only on 180 and I've just been preheating it for about 10 minutes. Cut them as big as you like and just keeping them a bit chunkier. I'm just cutting, I hope this is big enough, but three big pieces of foil because that's what I'm going to be putting everything into once it's all done boiling and just softening and then we'll just all go into the oven like that. I want it big to leave enough space because the, you know, depending how much food you have in there because you're sort of going to wrap it up in a Put your food in and then wrap it up a little parcel and let it cook inside. Um, this is just my new spiral. We're just gonna have a bit of um, aubergine with the fish on the side. So I just sort of try out my Christmas present for birthday present. Gonna drain my bed. And that's it, and I'm just going to start making up the parcels. And then just put your fish on top. And then a tiny bit of salt. To be careful, this comes up very quickly. Some pepper. Pepper, pepper, pepper. Some parsley, garlic, and as much lemon as you like. I'll just cut it in half and then you can see if I need some more. And then I'm gonna get a teaspoon and I'm just gonna take some of my butter here, a teaspoon, and put it on top. 
And then that's it. And then you just uh, wrap it in pasta, but you want to leave a tiny bit open on the side, just obviously so the heat can get in there. And then move it to your pan. And I'm going to do three of those. Leave a little bit open just so the heat can get in it. Right, so those are my three parcels. And then I am going to put that into the oven. That's already been preheated. And I'm going to put it in for about 20 to 25 minutes. And then I'll come back and check it. Uh, also going to put in my zucchini into the oven and that's just going to be like on the side for us because I wanted to try my spirilla so I'll check back with you guys later so this is the end result it's been about 40 minutes fish doesn't take that long my oven is a bit slow um, so just check it after 30 minutes because once fish doesn't take that long, so once the fish is cooked and your veggies are soft, your meal is basically done. And that, just shot, trying to use one hand, is basically oh, what it oh, looks like. So you put it on your plate, and then that is your meal. Basically, and you can use green beans or whatever else kind of veggies you like, sweet potatoes, you can even use different kind of fish. I use frozen fish, but you can use fresh fish um, or anything like that. And it's just a quick meal that you can make because uh, once a veg is soft, it's basically done because fish does not take that long to cook. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So that is it for this video, guys. I hope that if you do try it, that you like it. And if you do, then please let me know and what you think. Um, if you like this video, then please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. So, until next week, bye!